Today we are making watermelon pingsu. Pingsu is what we Koreans eat religiously during the summer months as our go-to dessert. And today I'm going to share my secret recipe with you on how to make pingsu without having to buy an expensive ice shaving machine. 오늘의 레시피 시원한 수박 빙수 만들기 오늘도 여러분들과 영어를 함께 하겠습니다. 짠! So all you need is a Ziploc bag, a blender, and your freezer to make pingsu at home. Ah, that's so delicious. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Helen and welcome to Modern Pepper. 안녕하세요, Modern Pepper의 Helen입니다. We need half a cup of water, half a cup of whole milk, and vegan friends, you can use rice milk or oat milk. And one scoop of your finest vanilla ice cream, a quarter teaspoon of your finest vanilla extract. If you don't have it, you know, just don't add it. And one cup of ice cubes. So put the lid on and make sure to remove the inner lid out. And take a wet paper towel and cover it like this. Put your hand on it and then turn your blender on. With the blender running, make sure to peel back and drop one ice cube at a time. And our last ice cube. And we're gonna pour our blended liquid in here in a Ziploc bag. And then I want you to fold the bag right where the liquid ends. Make sure to take out all the air. And then seal it. And then place it on a tray. Flatten it a little bit. And then just fold it over like this. And then put it in the freezer and let it rest for about good 20 to 30 minutes until it gets slightly crunchy. We're gonna cut the bottom of our watermelon. Just so that we could rest it flat. And then we're gonna cut it down the middle. I'm using a one tablespoon spoon like that and you can scoop it out like this so it's pretty but I like to do everything super fast so we're just gonna go in with our butter knife and then go in with our spoon and just dig it out and put it in our bowl and then just scrape around it and then we're gonna pour the rest in our bowl and we're gonna use this as our pingsu bowl Alternatively, you could freeze your watermelon bowl if you want to keep your pingsu super chilled. Now, if you love pingsu, make sure to also check out my pingsu four ways recipe as well as my coffee pingsu recipe. The video links will be listed in the description box below. All right, our pingsu mixture is ready. Okay, so it should not be completely frozen. It should be just so that when you press it, and this part is frozen solid, so what you need to do is take a rolling pin and just smash it out. So I'm using my watermelon bowl that I froze. And to this, we're gonna add our watermelon pieces. Fill it as much as you want, like so. And a heaping scoop of vanilla ice cream right in the middle. And then pick up the bottom corner and hold it upside down. And I want you to cut a big section off like this. And then you just pour. Isn't it crazy how easy it is to make this? It's our secret. Shh, don't tell the others. Just pat it down. So we're gonna cover our watermelon with our pinsu slush. Oh my goodness. So it's melt pretty fast. So we gotta go quickly, build your tower, and we're gonna add our pretty piece of watermelon. And this is an optional ingredient. I'm gonna add some red candied sprinkles all around. Put it around like that. And then a little bit of 
our fresh mint for garnishing and voila! So you have to eat this really fast. It's already like melting in between shots. Mmm! Popsicle freeze. But so worth it. So the best part is when like everything kind of melts and you have this lucut melting and the ice cream together. And you should always have a straw handy because you want to go in and... Ah, oh, that's so delicious. <laughs> Okay, so I want to thank everyone for watching today and if you enjoyed watching today's video, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it if you would click on that thumbs up icon and subscribe if you did not subscribe yet. 여러분 오늘 재밌게 보셨으면 꼭 좋아하는 버튼 눌러주세요. 구독 버튼도 눌러주시고요. 다음 비디오에서 뵙겠습니다. And I will see you in one of the videos you see right here.